today i know what a great way to start off a video <laughs> no, no no but hear me out so i'm a bit angry because the starbucks holiday drinks come out today on the fourth right and so every year they release the red cups as well on the same day so i rush over and i go up to the cashier and i'm like do you guys still have the red cups and she's like we don't get them until the 18th what this is news to me because on all the advertisement and promotional things, they didn't make they didn't specify that the cups were coming out the 18th. And so I was really unhappy about that. I'm still a bit salty, but it is what it is. What what can you do? <laughs> it's okay. They still had the drinks. They had like the other colorful ones. They just didn't have the red cups. But it also reminded me of that um, of that clip where Kim Kardashian's like swimming in the ocean or the pool or whatever, and she loses her diamond earring and she's crying. And then Courtney is like, "Kim, there's people dying in the world, so it's okay." But I'm still a bit salty. It's okay. It's okay. That's not what this video is about, though. Though I very much could turn into that. <laughs> no. Um. Let's get fit with Sandy. Tag me for Tag Tuesday. But. I saw that way too late, and then yesterday I was not in a filming mood at all. <laughs> so, tag Tuesday on a Thursday. I'm sorry, Sandy, but thank you for tagging me, and I hope you enjoy it. So, let's get into it. So, this is a would you rather. And, oh yeah, before I got Sandy's okay, I, okay, I was like, oh, is it okay if I do it on Thursday? And she was like, yes, that's fine. So, Thank you for that too, Sandy. <laughs> so anyways, it's a would you rather and Halloween or Halloween Thanksgiving edition. So let's, get, let's scroll. Would you rather cancel Halloween or Thanksgiving? Hands down, Thanksgiving. I love Halloween. It's my holiday. I've never, I have never ever celebrated Thanksgiving in that traditional way. I've done like Friendsgiving. I celebrate Black Friday, but... I never had like a real traditional Thanksgiving. It, does, it just doesn't hold that same emotional value that other people have. But Halloween, my oh my, do I love that holiday. It's staying. Would you rather catch a li <laughs> Would you rather catch a live turkey with your bare hands or empty the insides of 50 pumpkins? Um, okay, do you know how many calories I would burn running after a live turkey? Do you know how fast birds run? I'm not talking about those little jerks that can fly. I'm talking about the landbound ones. They run pretty fast, but turkeys are pretty big. But ostriches are big and they zoom around. So, but at the same time, I'm terrified of touching and catching birds. I tried to catch, I tried to touch a chicken once. I was at the LA County Fair. And I was like, and it was in a petting zoo, zoo and there was a chicken. So I was like, oh, let me touch it. Because my dad used to like raise chickens and he was like, they're really soft. So I'm like here and it just like zoo, like dashed across the thing. So I was, uh, I, anyways. But I am terrified of turkeys, especially when they come after you. They're like, <laughs> yeah, um, you know, what's also a workout carving pumpkins. I was spent carving my jack-o-lantern. I just got the top part done. So, but it doesn't say you have to carve it. It just says empty the insides of 50 pumpkins. I find that very, ther very therapeutic, getting out the seeds and all that. I'm going to have to go with that. Empty out 50 pumpkins. Would you rather eat an entire pumpkin pie or a gallon of pumpkin ice cream? I don't like pumpkin. <laughs> this does not seem fun to me at all. I tried a pumpkin pie once. I didn't finish the whole thing. I had a couple bites and it came from like a good place. It came from like the grocery store, which has really good stuff. So I, I but I couldn't finish the whole thing. Um, I know what I do. I would take the gallon of pumpkin ice cream, but I would melt it down, right? So I would wait until it's like melted and then I would just chug it and then follow it with the chaser. That's what I do. That's my answer. It doesn't say you can't do that on there. <laughs> All right. Where did it go? I like scrolled too far. Okay. So would you rather go a week gobbling like a turkey? <laughs> I like attempting it. Or talk with a mouthful of food for a week. Ooh. 
talk with a mouthful of food. Do you know how many points that is? Talking with a mouthful of food? Would I swallow it? And what's the point of having food then? I don't know. Oh. You know, would rather go be gobbling like a turkey. Maybe if I gobble like a turkey, people stay away from me. <laughs> no, I'd probably do talk with a mouthful of food. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> no solid reason, just I like food. I didn't get into Weight Watchers not liking food, I'll tell you that. Would you rather spend Thanksgiving weekend without football or shopping? Oh, football. But then again, I only watch football during the Super Bowl and I live for Black Friday. So that's an easy one. Let's see. Would you rather eat only turkey or mashed potatoes for an entire month? Fun fact, I've never had turkey. I've had the turkey deli slices like in my sandwich and stuff, but I've never had like an actual turkey how it's supposed to be cooked. So I don't know what it tastes like. I would assume it tastes just like chicken. I do like mashed potatoes too. Potatoes. Does it come with gravy? Let's be adventurous. Let's do eat only turkey because I'm assuming it tastes just like chicken. Correct me if I'm wrong on that. But then would I? you'd have to stuff it too. <laughs> this reminds me of that. Everything reminds me of something. But this reminds me of that episode on Cooking with Paris. Paris Hilton's cooking show on Netflix. It's so funny. It's, hilarious. it's not like a legit cooking show. You guys should watch it. It's so funny. I was cracking up. But it reminds me of the Thanksgiving episode where she's like making a turkey. And she's just so grossed out. It's so funny. She's like, ew. <laughs> And then it's funny because it shows that she goes to like go buy the turkey and she's like and she just runs away. It's hilarious. You, sh you should watch it. But um, turkey, turkey, that's my answer. Would you rather eat a raw onion or an entire clove of garlic? That's a hard one too. Let's go entire clo clove of garlic. Keeps the vampires away. Would you rather spend Thanksgiving Day wearing a pumpkin stem on your head or dress like a turkey? Dress like a turkey and then I could pretend I'm Pugsley Adams from the Adams Family. I don't know, it just seems fun. Dressing like a turkey. Wearing a pumpkin stem. How would you wear the pumpkin stem? Hmm. Dress like a turkey. There we go. Would you rather have been a Native American or a pil- or pil- or a pilgrim? at first Thanksgiving. Native American. And then I would have pulled a Wednesday Adams from Adams Family. I don't know why I keep bringing that movie up. I think I really want to watch that. I didn't watch it during Halloween, but I love Adams Family too. So, so my first answer was right. Counseling Thanksgiving and keeping Halloween apparently, <laughs> but yes. So, uh, would you rather attend Macy? This is the last one. Would you rather attend Macy parade? Or Rose Bowl Parade. Rose Bowl Parade. The Rose Bowl is like a sport. It's like a stadium and it has like sporting events and concerts and all that. I don't think they have a parade. They have a swap meet. I think this question means the Tournament of Roses Parade. And then the Macy's Day Parade. Ooh, that's a good one. I think the Tournament of Roses would be easier because it's in my own backyard. It's like 30 minutes away without traffic. <laughs> So, but, 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 um, so my university, they used to make, they used to make the rose, the, the rose float, the rose float, the rose per, tournament, the, what, the, the float, okay, they used to make the float made of roses, and then after that parade, they would just park it near the parking lot, and then you could, like, go in and take the flowers, it was really cool. You couldn't take the vials, but you could pluck the flowers, and I hope they do it this year, it's, like, really close to, so I hope they do it this year, because I'm gonna go and get the flowers, so anyways, that's not what this question is asking. <sighs> I love the Macy's Day Thanksgiving parade, though. They have the little balloons that flow and they have like awesome musical artists and they have the Rockettes doing their little leg things. Oh man, that's, I love watching it on TV and I feel like it would be so much more fun to like watch it in real life. And I've never been to New York. I'd like to go. I won't last five minutes, but I'd like to go. Um, let's see, the Rose Parade is pretty too and it has its own historic value and it's right in my backyard. 
But the Macy's Thanksgiving Parade has to win that one. I, re I, I think that parade is really cool and it's really fun. And I would love to see that in real life. So, yes, that's it. So those were my answers. Thank you again. Let's get fit with Sandy. I'm going to... I think I'm supposed to tag people, but is it too late? I don't know who to tag anyways. I'll leave the questions in the description. I don't know. Yeah, I'll leave the questions in the, in the description. So if you want to do it, or if you just want like questions for fun to ask your partner or your whoever, just for funsies, you'll have that option too. And I will also be linking Sandy below as well. Her channel is Let's Get Fit with Sandy. So thank you once again, Sandy, for tagging me. This is really fun. I had a great time. I forgot about my Starbucks drama already. <laughs> so thank you. And I will see you guys in the next video. See you later. Bye-bye.